Viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. When did you see Superman say, for Superman safety? When did you see Superman say that? Obviously, Captain Happy got a ranch who's a troll. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. It's a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. If you want to know what I'm doing here, I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Could you briefly tell us what the Third Amendment is? That's the walk of shame. You need to remember what you swore to protect. And my voice is terrible today. Please, sir, please don't make this look good. I'm begging you. Sir, please. They're going to make me sleep in jail. Why? Sir, please. Please, dude, please. Oh, my God, don't do that to him. You guys don't know what you're doing to me, man. Why? Why are you doing that? You guys really don't know what you're doing in my life with this, man. Seriously, please. Now, have your name and batch number, please. It's Captain Happy. God damn it. I also want to take a few seconds to thank my, uh, my paying subscribers. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. It means so much to me. It's helping me to keep the channel growing and producing great content. Thank you so much for your contributions. It means so much to me. Thank you. Welcome back, everybody. Today, we're going to be traveling to California where we're going to meet our wonderful friend, KC Sissy Boy. And let me tell you, he is such a sissy. He's filming on the, the property line or whatever they call that, the where the, the the town could go on to the public easement. He's filming from that. The old man that, that either owns the store or operates it comes out. And, you know, Casey Camera Boy, he's always kind of rude and ignorant to people when they ask questions. And even though he claims he doesn't want to be ignorant, he, he just still is. And then Casey Camera Boy cries. I mean, he cries because the old man apparently accidentally knocks the camera the, or the tripod out of his hand a little bit. And what does KC do? He calls for the police because he was assaulted and he wants to place a citizen's arrest on the old man. Well, the police come. They don't really want to do it, but they have to do it. And they tell him he's got to go to the DA's office or whatever it is to file the misdemeanor uh, charge or whatever they whatever it is in California. I don't know how that stuff works there. It's just it's just a nightmare. I'm gonna let you guys watch it. Enjoy. All right, Casey Camera Boy here, doing the First Amendment audit. That's a how point. can I help you? Look, you see that bird over there? Look, look, he's chasing that that bag right there. Oh see? yeah, it is, huh? Oh, guys. Yeah, it is actually. Yeah. Uh, you see that? Yeah. yeah. Got it right now. That's crazy, dude. Can you can you can your uh, camera zoom all the way up on that? I see. Yep, there's a bag. Are you guys parked That's around crazy, here somewhere? Uh... Can you like move away? You're like you're no. interrupting my shot. No, I'm. You're checking, taking pictures of our property. I'm just asking what you're doing. Yeah, uh, well, I'm working on a project. Can I move away, you know? No, you're no. blocking my shot. That's all these idiot frauditors know how to do is instigate trouble, and then when trouble happens to them, they cry like a little, you know what, to the police. Oh, he hurt me. He assaulted me. Well, no, he just knocked the camera out of your hand. Well, it's a part of my body. He assaulted me. No, it's not part of your body. But you're going to get the wrong person one day, and I can guarantee you the camera will be part of your body because they'll sh shove that camera so far up your butt. I'm not going to say any more on that one because of YouTube terms. But anyways, this fool goes around wearing a uh, Kevlar vest and a taser on his side. What do you think people are going to do? People are going to look at you, possibly question you and say, hey, what's going on? You know, and then you're going to be rude and ignorant to them and, and just try to give some attitude back. It's just stupid. We know what you're doing. We honestly know what you're doing for Auditor. You're just doing this for clicks and views. You're, gonna, you're trying to get a bad reaction. Why don't you look for a good reaction, maybe a positive reaction, and maybe you'll get more honey with it. Can you tell me, where's your vehicle? Doesn't you matter. Any idea on Are you sir? parked on our property? Yeah. Well, I don't want to have to call the police and ask for someone to have you removed for trespassing. You actually think I'm parked on your property? You are parked on my Are you parked on our property? You actually think I'm parked there. Like, I, I, I'm not trying to be rude, but I I, like, can, you, can you like, move? I You're stepping on my shot. You were taking pictures of our facility. Yeah, I'm working on a project. 
investigation. What project are you working on? It hasn't been disclosed yet. Can't see. Oh. It's funny that you have the American flag over there flying, but you're here trying to suppress my freedom and stuff. No, we're not trying to do that. We're just coming. It's unusual for somebody to come out and take photographs without authorization. And you're not you're not allowed to park on our property. So would you please move your vehicle off no. of our property? I thought it was session from who or what? So Casey Camera Sissy admits to being parked on the guy's property. Well, why don't you be considerate, you know? Why are you lying? Why are you being ignorant to the to the old man? You know, be respectful. You know, you're gonna get a lot more being respectful than you are gonna are gonna be being ignorant to the guy. The guy would probably actually go out of his way and help you and tell you what you want to know if you were actually kind of considerate. But you frauditors don't realize that. But unfortunately, like I said previously, it's clicks and views. That's all it is. These idiots are not upholding our freedom. We're not losing any freedoms. And we're not gaining anything. In fact, we might be losing some stuff because of these idiots. New rules and new laws are being put in place thanks to these scumbags. But they don't care. They got what they want. They got their sign. They got their clicks and views and all that other nonsense. I'm sorry. Just, this is private property. So just because we came and parked on here and took pictures of your building, or if we did park here, you're going to uh, call the cops on it? Hey, Sal. 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 Hey. He's talking to you. Would you uh, ask them to call the police and say that we have some people trespassing here? Oh, no. Thank you. Thank you, Sal. You got any ID on you, sir? That that's a that's a tatter tatter rent over there in Dick. So you're with some news media. Yeah. Who you with? You are. No, no. Who you with? Or you or... have any ID? Sir, for your safety and. Who are ours, you again? Can you step back a little bit because of the Corona stuff. Yeah, no, you're you like actually. Si no, you have property. to step back. No. We're not on your property. This is actually a terroristic uh, host there. I'm sorry. I can have you tra charged for that. I think all of you can agree with me. Casey Camera Boy is sucks. He really does. He is just a vile human being. And, you know, you know why, why talk to the old guy like that? I mean, come on. You know, going to charge him with a terroristic activity. Get out of here, buddy. You're, you're an idiot. You really are. I just, I just, I don't want to say any more. Just to let you know, it's coming up where the old man knocks the camera somewhat out of his hand. Not really fully out of his hand. Just enough to move the tripod. And, you know, Casey... He cries like a little. Well, I can't say it. No, we're just asking you what you're doing here. So I'm and filming. That, and we're asking why you're trespassing but you're on not our asking, parking lot. You're calling the cops, though. We did. We just did because you're trespassing. Yeah. Oh, we are? Yes. Oh, okay. I didn't know we're on your property. You are. Where oh, does okay. your property start? Right here. No. Oh, okay. It does. In the grass? It starts at that curb. No. Oh, okay. It doesn't. Look, I stand here. Would you please stand six feet back from. No. You came to us. We're six feet right now. You came so, to us. Um, you actually interrupting our job? Can you like actually go inside? No. I can have you charged for interrupting my investigation, sir. I'm being serious. This is why I can't stand this idiot. He he's just so disgusting. He's crying. He wants six feet, but when the old man said asked him to give him six feet, no, I'm not doing it. I mean, come on. Why do you have to be so rude and ignorant to these people? Yeah, can you leave us alone, please? Like, we're trying to work on an investigation right now. Like, we're really not trying to conversate right now. You're interrupting me right now. I can't have you charged for that. You're on our that. property. I'm not on your this, property. This is public property. This is public property, sir. It is not public property. It is. Not? No. It is. And, and how do you believe that is it's public property? Because it is public property. It's common sense. This is a street. It's common sense, sir. You don't is this, the, you is don't, this your vehicle here? You don't own the street. Is that no your, comment. Is that your Jeep right there? I'm just asking you. I, I own this facility. Where do you... Do you own the street? I really can't stand this guy. He is just so annoying. He's almost as bad as Maddie from upstate New York. He, he's just so ignorant and so disrespectful. I really wish karma would, would happen. I really wish karma would come and get him. He, he, needs, he needs to really learn a lesson. But anyways, you'll see it in a few seconds. The old man comes by and trips over his tripod. And, uh, well, you know what happens? Casey Camerboy cries like a little, well, I can't say because YouTube terms. But let's enjoy. No. Okay. You're interrupting us. Like, in a good way, I'm asking you to, like, like move out okay. of the shot. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 
Oops, I'm sorry. Really? Oh, so you did that? I'm calling the cops on you. I'm calling the cops on you. I just tripped. I'm calling the cops on you, idiot. Oh no, look at that. Really? Oh, so you did that? I'm calling the cops on you. There you go. Hey, I call the cops? Yep, what's going on? The guy from up there um, hit my camera and I got it on film. Okay. And he did it on purpose. Okay, are you so. hurt? No, but I mean, he hit my camera. I mean, okay, do you need medical aid right now? No, I know, because he hit my thing, not not me. So I'd like to. He's actually under private citizen's arrest right now. So I would. Um, I need his information. I want you to let him go. So I want to file a, a private citizen's arrest. Okay. What's up, man? Every time something happens with this fool, I'm placing you under citizen's arrest. Citizen's arrest. Citizen's arrest. Well, buddy, I hope you understand the legality of citizen's arrest. Because you can't just citizen's arrest anybody you please. Well, you could, but you open up yourself to possibly injury and lawsuits, you know. Because you arrest somebody without, without a legal reason, you know, you're kidnapping. That's a kidnapping charge against you. But maybe you already know that because you have your uh, $3 lawyer that you found in the mall. Yes, that's me. Oh, yeah, I, pl I placed the gentleman over there on the white shirt under citizen's arrest because he came and hit my camera on purpose. He's under citizen's arrest? Yeah. Then how come he isn't detained with you? Yeah, because it's not like a big of felony for me to detain him according to the penal code. That's correct. Yeah, see, uh, uh -huh. trying to get me in trouble or something? Or what? No, I'm not oh, trying okay. to get in trouble. Do you have your driver's no. license? No. I can give you my name. Okay, what's your name? Do you know your driver's license number? No, sir. You do not? No. Is it our, I'll, I'll look it up, okay? Okay. Do you know Please. your social? No. What's your address? How is it every time these frauditors want to arrest somebody or file charges against somebody, the officer says, can I see your ID so I could get, get the information down? Oh, I don't have it. Do you know your driver's license number? No. Do you know your social number? No. Do you know your date of birth? No. I'm not giving you any information. Well, then why should we take you seriously? Honestly, you want to charge the guy with a crime against you, but you don't, you don't want to give the cop the information? You're going to put good citizen down? What, what are they going to do? Send the... send the. Uh, I, I don't want to say anymore. I, my blood is just boiling watching this idiot. We're going to watch a little bit more of this. And that's it. I just can't stand any more of him. He's, he's just a piece of trash. So where were you at when this occurred? I was there. Uh, this is still where considered public easement. Right here where this... Uh, yeah. I was, I was like this. Where the Sprite? I was like this. So he okay. Came, so he came. So you were on you were on the property. Okay. That's not their property. I still um according to the law, it's thirty four feet from the center of the line. As you can see, there are those things that are owned by the city. Mm -hmm. So uh, well, I'm from not going to dictate okay. what is or what is. Oh, but that's There's still no public. sidewalk here. You understand? No, okay. the, uh, you you do see those things, right? That's for the public to come. Mm -hmm. But since um, they have so a lot of cement, right here? yeah. Okay. So since they have a lot of cement inside, according to the law, they have to. Um, they have a lot out of every, out of, out of every uh, um, certain amount of cement that they have on their property, mm -hmm. that's the amount of um, uh, green grass or green um, portions they are allowed them to have. So if you have 100 meters of cement, cubic uh, feet of cement, mm -hmm. you have to have like at least three meters of uh, green. Well, it's it's depend it's di that's different depending on your mun municipality. Whether you're no, it works here. Whether you're county, city, whatever you're doing. There's yeah, it works here. Depending on how many trees you're required to yeah, have and all stuff that. Like but that. that has nothing to do with it. Do it does with this one because I already looked it up. I'm sorry, I had it ended there. It, he's just, oh, he is just useless. And the argument with the cop, you know, the cop's trying to do his job, help you out, and you want to tell the cop all these laws and other stuff that you think you know. He, he's just, oh, God. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to like, share, and most importantly, it helps me out a lot. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Pay attention to the trolls, especially the ones that even name their channels, troll. You know, that's brilliant. What do you know?